So now let's see how to work around with Toon Boom by working around with frames and layers. So over here on the bottom, you can see that there's a drawing layer. So that is there by default. And this is the timeline as you can see right here. So now if we are to actually go over here and then draw out things. So I'm going to grab my pencil right over here. Click and drag this out just like this. And you can see that I have a shape. I can simply go on to the other layer right over here and draw another shape over here. Simply go to another frame over here, draw another shape. And you can see that you got a sort of an animation right here. So this is on the first layer. If I need to add a layer, what I have to do, so let's say I want a second layer where I want to draw more things. So what I can actually do over here is go and click this plus sign right over here. If I were to click on that, then I can add a layer as you can see. So there are different type of layers I can add, but right now we're just going to stick to drawing because that is what we're going with right now. So I'm just going to click on drawing. Now it asks me what type of layer I want. For now, I'm just going to leave them that into vector and add and close. Once you do that, you can see that another layer has been added. So I can go over here and draw anything over here and that stays on top. So you can see that this line over here is on the top layer while this is on the bottom layer. So if I want to move this around, so let's say if I want to add in this frame, move this around, it'll be much more easier. So if I were to have this, you can see that there's the top layer and there's the bottom layer and both of them form a group. If I have to have another layer, like let's say another drawing layer, I can rename it according to uh, what I'm comfortable with and press add. So you want to add in something like background and so forth. So you can select the layer and then draw on top of it. You want to select on the bottom one, what you have to do is select the bottom layer and then draw over here. You want to select this layer, draw on it and you draw on that layer. So each of them are grouped in a layer as you can see. As you make complex animation, this might prove to be a very, very useful. So let's say you want to delete a layer and just keep the bottom layer right here. I'm going to shift select both of these so both of them are selected as you can see. And to delete it, what you can simply do is right click just like this and click on delete or just click the delete key, it is up to you. So you can go, go over here, so both of them, and press the delete key as well, uh, so that really deletes the layers, um, uh, the, uh, that really deletes the uh, drawings of the layers, but not the layers itself. To delete the layers itself, just click the delete button, and there you go, you got just got the first layer over here. So if you were to actually select the drawing on the library panel right over here, so let me just reset uh, the default workspace right here so you can see it more clearly. So I'm re resetting the workspace right over here. And over here, if I were to go to library, you'll be able to see the drawing substitution. So you can actually see, you can see the frames here as well. And we're going to talk about that more in future lessons. So over here, you can see that this is how you control frames and layers inside of Toon Boom to help you get started with your drawing. And we're also going to come up more about how to work with timelines, onion skinning, and so forth in future lessons. So if you guys learn something as always, and as always, please like, comment, share, and subscribe.